rather special. They're not just stumpy molars like the ones we have. I'll show you what I mean. I've divided the sophisticated This is a reciprocating saw. Now, as you can see, it bears some resemblance to the teeth of a great white shark. And because it's going back and forth, it replicates its constant moving jaw action. So let's see what this does to a person today. Just like a great white shark's teeth, the reciprocating saw's blade has triangular cutting points. And like the great white, its cutting edge is constantly moving, enabling it to slide through this leg of pork with ease. Yeah, pretty gruesome. If that was your leg, you'd know about it. The great white has frightening teeth, certainly. But for having your arm off, I'm told there's nothing quite like the teeth of a tiger shark. Now, I realise this is getting a bit far-fetched, but this circular saw today is the tiger shark. Oof. No. The tiger shark. Okay. I reckon the action of this circular sword no, it was blade hurt is similar to that of the teeth on the tiger shark. You was hurting your brother. Yeah, straight through the bone and everything. Hideous. Anyway, if you hear this noise, when you're out in the ocean, you'll know what it is. Yep, it'll be a shark with a power tool. Hello. Back to the real thing with Dr. Gibson's specimens. Hello. It will go sharp. The, the serrations on the edge of the teeth are. And they will go like that. A serrated knife, exactly, yeah. You've got four or two hundred serrated knives in this job. What it does is saw it in. So it doesn't need a strong bite, it just needs to be a little bit of a flash off. It's you a like it, it's a state of the mouth of an animal. It's remarkable. Shark jaws are not as powerful as I expected, but the sharpness of the teeth more than makes up for that. What's more, if a shark loses a tooth, it has a limitless supply of reserves ready to roll into place. The sand tiger, for instance, gets through 20,000 teeth in a lifetime. How many do we get through? Those teeth are like an endless supply of lethal ammunition. True, a rottweiler has a more powerful jaw, and a lion has got bigger teeth. But if either of those animals loses a few gnashes, it's screwed. In my ratings, sheer number of teeth give the shark a winning score. Americans would pay a fortune for a mouth like that. But there's more. As a car enthusiast, I decided to look into the shark's power to weight ratio. Now, a typical great white shark can easily weigh a ton, and it will regularly do 25 miles an hour through the water when it's attacking its prey. And that means Ha, 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 ha.